lots of good things for us. Turnovers are low, that decent amount of shots up there. A couple of plays here or there that Kwani killed us on those three threes that he made. One in transition was a killer. We didn't find him soon enough, and then they threw a skip pass to him in the corner that hurt us. Uh, we had a couple of in and outs late that could have helped us a little bit, but overall, uh, hopefully we're getting better, we're getting there. Uh, I think it's a real good basketball team that we just played today. Again, lots of good stuff, but came up short. Questions? I know. You guys have seen when you have a trainer recently that's had trouble with the second half, coming out strong, kind of their way in the second half, what do you think is contributing? It's probably my poor halftime lectures. No, it's, uh, we, were, we were hanging, we, we, we've been worse than we were today on the, on the second half. Yeah, I hope so. Well, we're going to play a good game on Monday. We got a quick turnaround against a really good team. So we're going to have to be ready to go. We have no choice here. We got, we got to be ready to go. So uh, hopefully we will we'll pay attention to our details. This is a really good league. So every game, the 14 we have left, every game is going to be just a, an amazing challenge for us. So that's, that's what the charge is right now. Do you feel like Ryan Zans responded to the movement of the starting lineup? Yeah, I think he's doing a good job. I'm very proud of him. He's a hard worker and he deserves that opportunity. And he got himself nine rebounds today, which was formidable. I appreciate the, the effort that he makes every time he's out there. Coach Bear still a career high 12 assists. What do you see in terms of his core vision? Yeah, it's very good. He, he, he's so big and he sees over everybody. He's got a real good poise to him. He never, he never panicked once, whether he was bringing the ball up the floor or creating plays in the lane. I, mean, I, was, I was impressed with him. I, I think their whole team was very good. I mean, you guys, you know, thrive so much off getting to the rim, creating some mismatches, and letting Brickus and Bradley you know, kind of do their thing. When VCU has so much team length, how, how difficult was that for you guys? It seemed like every time they were trying to get a switch, they're still matched up on somebody who's 6'8", six, 6'9", six, and, you know. Yeah, we had a, a few problems finishing. I thought we did a good job in some of our plays and, and finished well, uh, but they are lengthy and they, they can shot block firm and a very good shot block as is well. Um, so I guess they got six on us today, but I, I thought it would be something like that. But they're, that's what they do. It's, it's what their defense is designed to do. But I thought we made some pretty good adjustments as to that. We probably needed to shoot a few more mid-range jump shots and not take it in there a few times. But they're good. They get a good team. Anything else? Coach? Thank you. Thanks a lot. Thank you, Coach.